Section 1. Mechanism of Holographic Moving Scrapping Therapy. What is the scientific reason for that scrapping a local skin can cure disease of the whole body? Generally speaking, there is no difference between malaria cutaneous bleeding induced by scrapping the skin surface and subcutaneous stasis of blood due to tumbling. But the two things have completely different results. In trauma, the blood shed is normal blood, with a large amount and bright red in color, and the stagnant blood retains in the space between tissues and cells, interfering blood circulation, pressing and stimulating the nerve, hence causing pain, even affecting local function. However, the malaria cutaneous bleeding is red and purple in color. It does not cause any pain. On the contrary, original pain disappears and the function restores immediately. Trauma causes rupture of the blood vessel. Only when the ruptured blood vessel and the surrounding tissues heal and the stagnant blood in the surrounding is absorbed can it restore to normal state. But the stasis of blood induced by scrapping the skin surface, little of bleeding and no complete rupture of the blood vessel, similar to rubbing and pressing it. Sometimes pressing can enlarge the space between cells, leading to that blood stasis or red cells come out from the vessel. The wall of the vessel restores very soon to the original state and the bleeding stops immediately when the scrapping completes. For malaria cutaneous bleeding, the blood exuded from the vessel and contains harmful factors. At attack of disease, metabolites accumulate in microangiums to turn to harmful factors to interfere blood circulation and normal exchange of substances, inducing disturbance of permeability of the capillary wall. The pressure of scrapping the skin can enlarge the space between capillary wall cells in the scrapped part, resulting in exudation of the blood containing harmful factors. After the harmful factors are exuded, microcirculation improves, fresh blood carries nutrient and oxygen, and permeability of capillary restores to normal. The malaria cutaneous bleeding will immediately stop with the transient contract of capillary after scrapping the surface of skin. Malaria cutaneous bleeding in color, shape, number is related with the constitution and patient's condition. The more the harmful factors, the darker the bleeding in color and the larger the area of bleeding, vice versa. Scrapping on any part with no harmful factors cannot induce malaria cutaneous bleeding. The bleeding could disappear after five to seven days. The process of disappearance can increase immunological function of the organism and strengthening capability of anti-disease. Why can scrapping the skin surface cure diseases of internal organs? Traditional Chinese medicine holds that mechanisms of scrapping treating disease are closely related to meridians that include channels and collaterals. There are 12 regular channels connecting with 5 zhang organs and 6 fu organs in the human body. These are main pathways for circulation of qi and blood. There are more than 300 acupoints on the 12 regular channels and conception and governor vessels. These branches are called raw collaterals, which connect with the skin surface, and the five zhang organs and six fu organs connect with limbs, five sense organs, and nine orifices as a whole. Meridian theory is intrinsic in traditional Chinese medicine, although the linear structures of meridians have not been found. In fact, they can exchange information, transport energy and keep circulation of qi and blood. Traditional Chinese medicine holds that the meridians can nourish yin and yang, keep circulation of qi and blood, and cure diseases. They are related to life and death and can regulate deficiency and excess. 
The meridians link up the internal organs, the internal organs and surface of body and the body surfaces. The skin parts are regions of functional activity of channels and collaterals in body surface. To be brief, the channels and collaterals are like a long river system, and the skin parts are like its drainage at the body surface. The skin parts of 12 regular meridians govern a vessel and conception vessel distribute in the body surface. In the process of scrapping and point pressure scheme, external force acts directly on the skin parts of meridians, opening sweat pore, dilating capillary, accelerating blood circulation and lymph, promoting excretion of metabolites, so as to activate blood circulation to remove blood stasis and improve microcirculation. Scrapping the skin can stimulate nerve endings, strengthening conduction function of nerve cells so as to improve and strengthen functions of internal organs. According to the meridian theory, benign changes of local skin can regulate corresponding organs via meridians. On the basis of meridian scrapping therapy, biological holographic theory is enrolled, forming new holographic meridian scrapping therapy. What is the word holography? Holography is whole information. In traditional Chinese medicine, Pao's feeling and observation of tongue coating can help to diagnose disease, suggesting that the tongue and the artery in the wrist can reflect signs of some diseases. But some relatively independent parts in the human body can also reflect the information of the body, such as the trunk, head, ears, heads, feet, or some smaller local organs, which are called holographic embryo of all information. The corresponding area to an internal organ in the holographic embryo is called holographic acupoint area of the organ. Scrapping these holographic acupoints can diagnose and treat diseases of the body. How do the holographic acupoint areas distribute? This is commonly seen holographic acupoint area of the ear. It looks like a human shape upside down. There are holographic acupoint areas of various internal organs in the palm, and the back of the hand is an aptome of vertebrae. This is acupoint area distribution atlas of internal organs on the foot, showing the acupoint areas of the head, five sense organs, and internal organs. The arc of foot is corresponding area of vertebrae. The forehead from the middle part to bilaterals corresponds respectively to the head, thoracical cavity, upper abdomen, and urogenital system. Lateral sides of the head are two human shapes with the head downwards. From the lower to the upper, it corresponds to the lateral of head, upper limbs, lumbosacral and lower limbs respectively. The vertex region of head is like a human shape of supine position, corresponding to the all internal organs. Posterior region of the head is an aptome of human back. The upper corresponds to the neck and shoulder, thoracic and lumbar vertebrae. This is holographic acupoint area of eyes on the upper occipital bone, and this, the cerebellum on the lower occipital bone, which can treat diseases of the cerebellum and disturbance of the motor of hands and feet. The second metacarpal bone of the hand corresponds to a human shape standing up. From the upper to the lower, it represents in order holographic acupoint areas of the head and neck, heart and lungs, liver, stomach, lower abdomen, and lower limbs. Corresponding area of vertebrae on the back is the largest holographic embryo areas in the human body. Scrapping the cervical and lumbar sacral vertebrae can treat diseases of the four extremities. Scrapping the cervical vertebrae can treat diseases of head, five sense organs, neck and shoulder. Scrapping the thoracic vertebrae can treat diseases of the internal organs, and scrapping lumbar and sacral vertebrae can treat diseases of the large and small intestines, kidney, and urogenital system. 
The internal organs have corresponding projection areas on body surface. The holographic acupoint area of the head is determined by functions of cerebral cortex. The anterior region of the neck is projection area of thyroid on body surface. The chest and back regions are projection areas of the lung and heart on the body surface. Both chest and coastal regions are those of liver, spleen and pancreas. Umbilical and abdominal regions are that of the large and small intestines. Scrapping these projection areas can prevent and treat directly the disease of their corresponding internal organs. Professor Hao Wan Shan in Beijing University of Traditional Chinese Medicine and Pharmacy put forward the concept of meridian tree, which can help to understand the relations between the holographic acupoint areas and internal organs and meridians. Meridians are regarded as a big tree. The internal organs are its roots. The channel is its trunk. The laterals are its branches. The leaves of the tree are many reflective parts of internal organs on body surface, which are called holographic acupoint areas. Any disease of the tree should involve the whole meridian tree, so sensitive points tenderness would appear in the trunk. Color change, pressure pain, prominence or excavation occur on the leaves. Both scrapping the holographic acupoint areas to activate the leaves and scrapping meridians to dredge the branches can treat pathological changes of the roots. Scrapping different parts can promote regulative function of all meridians. Balance yin and yang, qi and blood activate immunological system and strengthen capability of anti-disease. Holographic meridian scrapping therapy is not only used for treatment of causes and position of disease, and also it can play the role of preventing and treating diseases without affecting normal physiological function of the human body via stimulating local holographic acupoint areas of particular organs on the body surface and acupoints to activate channel qi, regulate meridians, and strengthen the capability of anti-disease. Therefore, holographic meridian scrapping therapy is a non-pharmacotherapy with no side effects. According to the theory of holographic meridian scrapping therapy, acupoints of many areas can be selected to treat pathological changes of some parts of organs. As compared with the old scrapping therapy, the holographic meridian scrapping therapy is more flexible in acupoint selection. For example, scrapping related meridians on the back, abdomen and the upper and lower limbs or projection region of stomach on body surface, corresponding area of stomach on vertebrae or holographic acupoint areas of stomach on the head, ear and extremities can be used for treatment of gastric diseases. Generally speaking, the second scrapping therapy can be followed only after the first malaria cutaneous bleeding disappears. However, for the holographic meridian scrapping therapy, the holographic areas of various local organs in the body can be selected alternately for treatment. Also, right areas can be selected for treatment of diseases on the left side, the lower areas for the upper and the back areas for the anterior, so it can be used for consecutive treatment. Because of the holographic acupoint areas are located at the exposed parts of the human body, one can apply the therapy while watching television, reading or chatting.